morning guys I am currently up the woods just started a series on kind of spending long term in a bell tent so me and Lou recently went halves and decided to buy this really nice bell tent and um, do and do a long camp out in it just see what it would be like obviously spring's on its way so it's quite a nice time of year to come out and spend a long time in nature everything's just bursting and coming to life now so it was a good opportunity to get this yeah so I'll be starting a series on that should be good it'll be just um, probably like daily videoing of what we get up to whilst we're here and what it's like inside and it will be a whole series of kind of living in a bell tent for a little while I've seen a few videos like that and they're really inspiring they're really cool just people going out setting these up and living in them they're really nice canvas material so you can have a wood burner inside and they heat up really well we've had quite a few cold nights it's been really cold so it's definitely been nice to have a bit of luxury and a bigger tent to sit under so this morning I am making a coffee over the fire so I'm having this coffee I used it in a recent video and people asked about it so I just thought I'd show you the brand and what flavors you can get so this one is oak chocolate and honey base camp blend so pretty convenient for what I'm doing and then floral nutty and citrus and you can also get loads of other different flavors they come in sachets and other small little sachets and it's got a really cool filtering system where you just put it on your cup lean the two handles on your cup and it filters it so it's awesome it's ground coffee and it's got its own little filtering system and it comes in tiny little squares so it's really good for backpacking you don't have to take one of these huge filters that you usually have with coffee you just need tiny little sachet you get five in these bags so that would do you for like if you drink coffee a lot a weekend or longer depends how often you drink coffee but they're definitely really nice really good so I'm gonna have one of these this morning So that is the simple filtering system you can see it just fits onto your cup and all very different types of cups which is great this is just a classic camping one but yeah it smells so good coffee's really strong it's just such a simple but effective way of filtering ground coffee
so I've got my coffee now I'm gonna enjoy it it's such a simple process and I love the filtering system and it tastes amazing it's just oh it's really great especially if you're a coffee lover then this is definitely something that you need to get So I'm really looking forward to uploading the Bell Tent series. I'm still in the middle of it. It's day seven today. So me and Lou have done a week here. And um, yeah, it's a great, it'll be a great little series. Um, just showing you what we get up to and what it's like getting a Bell Tent. How did you uh, find the Khufu coffee? Do you like it? The Khufu coffee. Um, you rate it? Yeah, the Khufu coffee, give it five star. Great texture, great taste. It's really strong. It really kicks you into gear. Um, it's good for the mornings, isn't it? It's good for the mornings. You drink it, within 10 minutes, you're running around. Yeah, you're, yeah. A, you're a wood prep. You're a wood prep. Normally, I'll be laying in bed till <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to get up and like face the day, but as soon as you take a shot of that coffee, coffee yeah, just hits you, just hits you. Gets you up, doesn't it? Yeah. Starts the day. Yeah. yeah it's Real good stuff, good. isn't it? Yeah. So what's your thoughts on the bell tent then, day seven? Well, it's definitely the best tent I've stayed in, by far. <laughs> Oh, it's better than a pop-up tent. <laughs> yeah, well, that's, why, that's why I'm saying it. Um, it's really spacious, roomy, um, especially with the wood burner in there as well. Yeah, you love that on. In there. It's really, it's really luxury in it. Warm, yeah. So a massive thanks to John for that wood burner. It's proper nice. Yeah, John over in Somerset gave yeah. us that lovely wood burner so handy for just all different sort of tasks in it yeah it really is really good to have that you can have that in the tent so yeah loving the bell tent life mm, that's what we've been doing our coffees on in it most mornings instead of an open fire so yeah. first open fire so it's quite nice to sit out in the sun the nice fire yeah, going is first day we've been able to do this yeah it's been really bad weather really grim rain wind it's just but it's nice having a bit of sunshine yeah get some of that uh vitamin d so this is the bell tent this is our wood stores collection the wood's been really wet so we've had to dry it around the burner so that was a priority. Yep, and this is the wood burner that John gave that us. That John gave us. So got that up and running. It's an outbacker stove. Really nice. And there's a vent for it to come out just there. Yeah, and this is my bed that I've got. So it's proper. That was a bargain, wasn't Luxurious it? Luxurious in here, as you can see. Pat, you picked it up for a tenner, didn't you? Yeah, I did. Nice bed chair. Yeah. <laughs> Just a job, <laughs> Definitely it? worth it. Um, yeah, this is a spell tent. 
yeah, really roomy, as you can see. We're still sorting out bits and bobs in here, getting it all sorted. Obviously, you need a lot of gear for a long time. But we're getting there, aren't we, Lou? And this, we've got our candle collections. And this is one that one of our great friends made us, John. Another John that we know. <laughs> all the Johns. Yeah, so I definitely want to make a candle at some point in time. He's calling it. With yeah. The can. It smells, what's that? Citronella. Oh, for yeah. For the bugs. It smells like a. Uh, Good idea, isn't it? Sweet, doesn't it? <laughs> it does. It what does. sweets are you even No, eating? I don't know. You just got that that smell to it. It's nice, though, isn't it? It is nice. I have to the old John. get that going. Didn't you say it's got mosquito repellent? <laughs> yeah, citronella. It's always that keep, what keeps them, the mozzies away. Mm, that's the one. Yeah, needed that in tans, didn't I? Yeah. Mm. It's nice, eh? So this is the 4x4 four four one. There's all different sizes you can get. We decided to get this one. It's just a nice size for two. Well, if you're interested, we're going to be doing a series soon. So stay tuned to check it out and see how it goes. So if you are interested in the Khufu coffee, then I will leave a link below this video so you can have a look and see all the different flavours and the different packaging you can get. You can get the big five coffees, the five sachets in one bag or just the individuals. So yeah, I'll put that in the description below. So thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope that you we'll go over to that series and watch that because it's going to be a great series just daily vlogging what we get up to so yeah and if you're interested in that <laughs> if you're interested in that coffee please look at the description below so thanks for joining and i will see you in the next video cheers guys big thank you to all my patrons as well for your support i really appreciate it if it weren't for you, this video wouldn't be possible. So, thanks a lot.